Hello everyone, welcome to Mickey and My Craft. This is your host, Hilda. As I explained on the unboxing of these um, two items to a storage um, previously, I was going to do one uh, showing you and to see if it fixed some of the drills that I have not kit up yet. Um, however, I decided later, well, let me do it and then give him uh, the demonstration only of how the, to put the kits in. And, um, but I found out something and you can see in the photo, sometimes the poor glue is out of place. And I tried to use Goo Gone and it, uh, erased the paint on this, so I have to resort to um, Sharpies to use it, which is in this area over here. Okay, so I did an experiment, which came out good. Okay, you see the drills are there, they're not gonna go anywhere, and it's a sticky, okay? And while I was drilling, I come out with this situation again. The thing is, is so on the top one, as you can see, doesn't have any glue on it. So I don't want to take a chances, even though I seal this with Liquitex, with you will see later, uh, the, it's this one. Well, you will see later. Um, I, um, I don't want to take a chance, so. I'm going to take this glue off and I'm going to use tacky over and over. And I saw this in a stitcherista when she was trying to do a custom uh, herself and she was using this to pour on the canvas. And um, so we're going to do this. I'm going to keep on drilling, which is going to be doing uh, fast forward. And then we going to try to fix these baby boys in there. Okay. Um, first, let me show you how I resolve it because in items like this, you might find it some way, some, some later. So you don't want, um, um, how you say it? You don't want, um, Oh, I forgot to drill this one. This one is okay. Um, you don't want, um, they fall off and you don't want to discard the item or do something else. So how do I get that glue that is out? Well, you just use a simple kitchen towel with water. Because if you use glue gun, it's gonna take a little while You see, it was okay on these ones, but you know, I don't want to take any chances. And I want to do this correctly. So I took away some water, right? And then I gave it a coat well two coats actually of tacky over and the advantage of this is like the diamond dots glue uh, is that you don't have to have a three millimeters thickness and with two coats you do one coat let it dry for 20 minutes and uh, then you do another coat and let it dry uh, as soon as dry, when you touch it, it feels like it's not dry. It feels like it's still slimy. And um, what you can do is, um, you know, uh, wait a little bit longer. But still, I put my drills on it over here. I put my drills on it and they're okay. There's no problem with them. Okay, and um, so um, let's get started. You can either, you can do it either way. You can do it right here this way. Oops, 
I'm putting it in, a, <laughs> in top of the paper. Let me get it out. She didn't realize that. Come on, get out. And uh, you can put it on top over here. It's kind of a milky white, but it's going to dry clear. And it doesn't matter if it goes outside of it. The important thing is that you cover your thin. Oh, I'm going to take a little bit of the excess. Because this one, it should be good enough for the first time. And I probably don't have to put a second coat on it. You just let it dry. It's going to dry uh, clear. In the meantime, I'm going to put the drills over here and until it dries up. Okay? So I'm going to fast forward a little bit while we do this and uh, see you in a bit. So... I gave it about 45 minutes because I give it I gave it a second coat and uh, still sticky, slimy, but we're gonna put them on. You see they stay there. That's it. So remember, uh, scrap the glue on the side that is not on the symbol with um, a, a small kitchen towel and water. That's all you need. And do it delicately and you... Um, uh, superficial little by little uh, layer by layer until you get the glue off so and then you use the tacky over and over with a thin brush in this case because all depends on the symbol you might can use another thicker brush this is from the paint by numbers kit so and this one, the advantage of this one, it doesn't require three millimeter thick glue, uh, you know, of glue between each uh, coat that you gave. You have to wait about almost an hour to do it. And I'm on, I can wait, but not that long. <laughs> so I use this one. Probably in the future, I'm going to use it for something else, a uh, custom thing that I make. So I'm going to keep on drilling this and when I come back, I'm going to show you how to seal it with Liquitex. The advantage of Liquitex and since these are soft items, it will keep the softness because Mod Podge tend to stiffen the item. I noticed that on the big canvases. Um, so I'd rather have the Liquitex, which takes about one hour to dry out, depends on how you do it. So um, I'm going to drill the rest of it. And then when I come back, I'll show you the Liquitex and we will try to see if all this will fit in there. Okay. See you later. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave it over here. Um, I know for you it has been a couple of minutes, but I'm almost done with this, but I got to go and pick up my husband. So I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow I will show you how to um, seal this with liquid text and then we'll put up the um, unkitted drills on it. Okay, so have a wonderful night. Happy dreams. And remember, love and peace above all. Thank you.